Hey guys, Liz here from girlgonefunny.com. And when you were in primary school, did you ever play a game called Heads Down, Thumbs Up? I know we did, and I can't actually remember the point of it, but it was where you'd put like your head down on your desk and you put your thumbs up and someone would come and touch them. Um, I don't actually know, I have no idea what it was for, but I remember it being really fun. And it was also for an eight year old, hilarious, when the boys would rhyme thumbs with another body part. Ha, huh, outrageous eight year old humor. Um, so why am I telling you about heads down, thumbs up? Why? why? Um, so, you know, when you have like a goal or something you want to achieve, um, something you're working on, it's so easy to kind of get distracted, um, to get your focus pulled away to somewhere else, especially in like the world of social media. You know, it's so easy to get distracted by bright, shiny things or looking at someone's feed and thinking, oh my goodness, you know, they're so much further ahead than me. You know, they're so much more successful. They've got it all together and get kind of distracted from what you're wanting to do and how you're feeling about yourself. You know, I know sometimes I look and I'm like, oh my gosh, it's all been done already. Oh my goodness, they're so much further ahead. You know, even though I find other people's success, you know, super inspiring and I love it. Sometimes I'm just like, it's, it's too much. It's too overwhelming. And this is where heads down, thumbs up comes in. So it's not heads down, thumbs up though, because I can't even remember the point of what that game was. But the other day when I was looking at something, I'm like, oh gosh, overwhelm. I was like, this little voice was like, heads down, thumbs up, Lizzie, heads down, fun up. And I'm like, oh my gosh, head down, fun up. I'm like, I like that. I'm going to make that into a little like quote, Instagraphic and put it on Instagram. But yeah, heads down, thumbs up, not thumbs up, freak, fun up, fun up. Um, so what does it mean? Heads down means get on with it for goodness sakes. You know, if you're getting distracted, stop the distraction, get rid of it, you know, block, can, you know, delete, you know, shut down your newsfeed, just like blinkers on, you know, full steam ahead. You know, that comparison, it's such a killer for creativity and yeah, it's just nasty. Comparison is a killer for creativity and ideas and moving forward. So if you can put those blinkers on, you know, heads down, all systems go, you will achieve so much more, I promise you. And second, fun up. Oh my goodness, no. If you're not having fun, why are you doing it? So I guess, you know, there's things in life that's not always fun, you know, maybe our job or, you know, special family gatherings that you'd rather not go to. It's just, you have to do it. But if there's something that you're working on, you know, whether it's a creative project or something for you, make sure it's fun. If it's fun, then it's so easy to keep going, to get motivated. If it's not fun, maybe think about ditching it. So that's what I mean. Heads down, fun up, like seriously. Um, and I keep repeating it to myself where I'm like, my attention's like, whoop, whoop, whoop. Um, heads down, fun up. So I would love to hear from you. What do you think of heads down, fun up? Did you ever play heads down, thumbs up? Can you tell me what the point of it was? Um, come on over to girlgonefunny.com and let me know. I, as always, would love to hear from you and I will see you next time. Thank you. Peace. You know what thumbs rhyme with? Bums. And bums are hilarious. Even, how old am I now? Almost 32, eight. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad at that. 24? 24 years later, bums, hilarious.